In this video, I'm going to teach you how to learn a 360 in less than a month. If you're just getting started in wake surfing, there's a few fundamental things that you need to learn before you start trying the 360. And I made a completely free three-step guide to achieve constant progression that you can get at the link in my description. This guide will make sure that you're set up for constant progression to the 360 and even past that. So if you're new to wake surfing or even if you've been doing it a while, go ahead and download that free guide. If you want to learn a 360 in less than a month, then you need to break it down into steps. Weeks one and two, focus on doing a lip slide and learning how to disconnect the fins. The lip slide is gonna help you learn how to disconnect your fins instead of trying to spin into a 360. The 360 is not really a spin, it's more of a pivot as you're coming forward. So you need to know how to release your fins. To release your fins and to do the lip slide, you're gonna start at the back of the wave which you always start at the back of the wave for every trick you do. Start coming forward and as you come forward you're going to reach your back hand into the wave. As that hand goes into the wave your front knee is going to drive up to your back shoulder as your back leg scoops the back end of the board towards the boat. That back leg is disconnecting the fins and that's what's getting it to release and do that spin motion. You want to think about keeping your core tight and your chest tall. You don't want your chest to fall over or, else, or it's going to slide out on you. So think about keeping that chest tall. The core stays tight and it stays straight. So your lower body is rotating as your upper body stays straight. So like I said before, weeks one and two, really focus on that. The first week, only try that. If you can go out three, three times a week, that'd be best. Three times every time that you go out, focus on that lip slide and really learning how to release your board. Once you start to get that down on week two, you can start incorporating the 360 attempts, but still really focusing on that lip slide and getting it to disconnect. So for every one 360 that you try, you should be trying about five lip slides. So get up, try five lip slides, and then try your 360. When you go for your 360, focus on letting that upper body stay aligned with the lower body. So you're gonna think about it the exact same way as the lip slide. The only difference is you're letting your upper body go with that lower body this time. So the lip slide, your lower body's rotating. Now the 360, everything is staying aligned. When you think about the 360, you don't wanna think about it as trying to spin into it. It's just a pivot as you're coming forward. You wanna get up and around the whole top of the wave. You want the way, you wanna be rotating around the peak of the wave. Now that you got a few 360 attempts under your belt and you're starting to, maybe you're coming around on them, maybe you even landed it by now. If not, no worries. Now go one to one. So for every one lip slide that you try, every time you get up, try one lip slide and then try a 360. Just do that over and over on week three and then see where that takes you. Depending on where you got on week three, week four, you just want to go straight for the 360. Try that just over and over. Try your 360 over and over. Repetition is key, you have to try the trick to be able to land it. If you feel that your 360s aren't coming around correctly and you're not releasing the board, go back to that lip slide again. So maybe try five 360 attempts and if they're not going around well, they're not releasing, try the lip slide before you do your three. This should ideally help you to land your 360 in less than a month. I know you wanna keep progressing at wake surfing so I built a free three-step guide to constant progression like I mentioned before. You can get that at the link in my description. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you subscribe for a video every Wednesday on wake surfing.